Oh. Oh, you're going to play the horse farm. You're going to go play with the horses again. Want to play with horses? Hmm. Oh. Should get a horse to tug on a rope. Do horses tug on ropes? Oh. And today, today we tackle this again. This situation. Waiting on Ernie, we gotta go to the shop today. I'm gonna make sure that everything is running how we need it to run. Go check on things. We lost power yesterday, as I said. Just wanna make sure everything gets shipped out today. We got just some stuff to work on for this You Are Your Enemy drop Sunday. And then just gonna hang out at the shop today a little bit. Okay, so I was uh, doing a little bit of research on the 747 event. My tickets aren't here yet, but I don't think anyone's gotten their tickets yet. So here's a couple of things about the rules of what items are prohibited. One, there is no drugs of any kind. Marijuana is excluded. No drugs or drug paraphernalia. Blah, 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 none of this stuff really matters, but this, no professional cameras, detachable lens is the part that has me a little annoyed. And I understand like concerts, you can't normally bring this stuff and there's a lot of bands playing, I get it. But it's kind of annoying, as well as no selfie stick or tripod. So you can't even like carry the thing around and hold it. So that's fucking annoying. No Sharpies or markers, which again, I understand like people are gonna like hack shit or whatever. But um, you know, I don't really, I don't really know what to tell you. Um, I'm gonna have all this shit with me. I don't, I don't really know. Like, I'm definitely gonna have markers. Like, what? No audio recording devices. Um, no hoverboards. If you shovel the hoverboard, you should go home anyway. Uh, no misters. I don't know what that is. I don't know what a mister is. I, my mind went to a very dark place when I read that one. Yeah. So I don't really know, it's kind of whack, so I'm gonna have to... I have other cameras, like I have this camera, which I've busted to shit, the thing doesn't even close anymore. This camera I have, and it's great, like it works, it's a really nice point and shoot camera, but I don't vlog from it. And the main thing with vlogging is audio. So I have to buy a separate audio recorder, which I'm not even supposed to have that with me. So I'm already flying here, I have to do all the stuff. I have to fly here, get a hotel, buy all these shoes if they give me the uh, option to actually buy them, and then, um, you know, not be able to record it with anything. But then it says, can I take photos? Can I bring a camera? Yes, take photos and videos highly encouraged. Be sure to tag your shots. That's great, but you're making me fucking do the bootleg booty ass shots. Like I got real cameras, I spent. And then the top list too, it says, since marijuana is legal now, does that mean I can use it at the 747? Marijuana and marijuana products are not allowed inside the 747 warehouse event. If that changes, we will update this answer. Make sure you check that answer if you're trying to blaze up at the 747. Oh, I'm gonna call it now. This is gonna be uh, kind of a shit show maybe. We'll see. I'll be there Friday and Saturday. I don't know what I'm gonna film on. I guess I can film on this and get another mic and maybe get another point and shoot. This is stupid. I'll figure it out. There's uh, been a slight change of plans because Ern is not gonna make it here. So I'm gonna Uber to the shop. Did I even grab my phone? Yeah, I did, okay. And I don't really like it because the Uber pull. Yeah, Uber pool's really weird. I don't understand it. It was funny. It was two girls I picked up and two guys I picked up. Uh -huh. They ended up wanting to go together and have a beer. Oh, uh, nice. Well, I guess that worked <laughs> out. Yeah, fuck it. I went snowboarding this week, but I jacked up my knee. So now I'm just kind of like, fuck. Oh, really? Yeah, I hit a tree going really fast. Oh, and I didn't yeah. like. Well, I think anytime you hit a tree, it's going to hurt. Yeah, I just didn't like, just didn't gauge it. You know, like, and my knee, I'm so big that my knee was just. I thought I was going to barely clip it. And I like, straight up, I mean, it put me to a stop. You know? How fast do you think you're going? Probably I don't know. Miles yeah, miles at miles? least. Like, I mean, trees, I'm not like blazing like I am down at run, but still, I was going. Going pretty, I mean, it was all powder, so it was like a nice powder day the other day. So it was just like cruising. Yeah, I've run into quite a few things in my face as a kid. Yeah, future. Oh, 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 oh. Thanks. Uh, oh, I'm, a, I'm a pass. <laughs> First of all, first thing I've eaten all day. Why aren't you eating? I'm starving. Me. Why does he feed you like a cat? Yeah, I don't understand. Like, why, does, why is he's always like, I gotta go feed Brandy. And I'm like, is she an iguana? Like, what? <laughs> You got a banana crocodile or whatever it's called. I'll hold you for weeks. 
<laughs> Been here since early this morning. Be here super late tonight. A whole ton of stuff. I'm here shipping now. My Twitch playing got me demoted to shipping. So I'm here shipping. I'm no longer playing Twitch in the morning. Hopefully soon once we get all this customer service fixed. I got everything in my cell phone now. So if you guys hit us with an email, go and direct to me. I'll make sure that stuff's taken care of. I know we have some stuff from the past and this and that. I've gone through that. I've answered every email. If you emailed months ago and just gave up or something, you know, email again because I will answer those emails. I can't go back through thousands of emails from everything. I'm trying to go back as far as I can, but if you've had an issue, email us. I work for Vice. We're doing a thing on ex-convicts that are tattooing now. <laughs> I had to lay low for a while. Nice. You guys have fun up there at Snowboard? What are you doing now? <laughs> what? I don't know, talk to you. It's a I'm food tour with Derek. Oh, really pretty good, dude. So, yeah, artificially yeah. flavored. Guacamole. A lot of stuff going on. It's about 2 o'clock. We're on our 6th, 5th, 6th carts that are about to go over. We got to pack a ton of stuff. You know what? I'm going to take you guys into the basement so you can watch me try and fulfill all these orders. She hasn't talked to me all day, not one word. More work, less chatter, let's go. What's that? Bran? What? Where's the A? Hey, I vert crew, Gray. One of my faves. Some's upstairs, some's downstairs. But no matter where you get your stuff, don't forget your sticker. Danny's yet to talk to me yet today. Because he returned in January the King Kong NYC hoodie and the Windbreaker and never got credit. So it's like fucking 80 and 160. Jesus. Crazy is that this dude is nice enough to just wait on $195. Printing? Yeah. Yeah, he's still printing up there. And at, honestly, as soon as you sign them, those are going today. <laughs> Yeah, make sure to get my vans on there. <laughs> I did, don't worry. <laughs> I get the back view, I could do like an on feet. Yeah, yeah, give us 360. Yeah, nice. Uh, I, need to, I need to get out of here. Away, Teddy. I'm here, it's me. It's me, Maddie. What's up, buddy? It's me, Teddy. Oh, shit. How's it going? I tell you, you weren't here. What? Literature drown. All the fucking cheese sticks up in this bitch. Look at that. That's what they're supposed to look like, so. I should do a, a mozzarella stick with Morrissey on the box. Yeah, they should. That's what I think, I mean. Yeah, because it's not going to fit. So just have to say here. I'm sure it's fine. Okay. Why? Right, all right. Earn. Always. You can earn. I need a 747 event. Uh oh, what? Guess what's not allowed? Weed? Well, other than weed. No cameras that have detachable lenses. No professional cameras are allowed in the building. No tripods are allowed in the building. No, no selfie sticks. So we have to basically use the point and shoot, the GoPro, and the video camera, I'm assuming. It's okay. Or we'll buy another it. fucking camera. Are we allowed the GoPro on the gimbal, or is that illegal? Know, Does that become professional right away? Professional yeah, I'm sure that, dude, I bet you it is. Because yeah. if you can't have a selfie stick, it's the same fucking yeah. thing. I'm gonna get kicked out, that's my plan. Yeah, let's get like, kicked out. Okay, like, yeah, I'm just gonna bring all my shit and then get kicked out. I'm like, cool, they kicked me out of 747. Yeah. Whatever, whatever. But. Now, what if you get a press pass? Well, I don't think they're giving out press I think that's the problem. Oh, that's oh, good. I won't complain. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I'll spare you the craziness. Yeah. Okay. All right, shipping is in order. Everything is on its way. Domestic stuff, basically everything shipped today. There's a little bit of stuff going out tomorrow. International stuff leaves tomorrow. And then we're done. And then uh, everything should have been fixed. If you've gotten an email or even a text from Ernie, you already know what's good, but pretty sure we finally have all the bullshit ironed out. Smooth sailing from here on, God willing. Yeah, shout out to Ernie and Brandy for just like, completely crushing the shipping department now. And shout out to you guys, you guys cleared out the store. It's pretty much empty. The only thing left, maybe if there's a some prints left, 
The snake print, there were only 100 made. I know that half, like half are gone. So uh, if you want one of those, you should probably get one before they're gone. Uh, and once they're gone, they're not coming back. I know a lot of people wait and wait and wait and then beg me months later to redo stuff. It's not really my style, so act quickly. And then Sunday, we're dropping the You Are Your Enemy drop. I think there's three different shirts dropping. I've posted all but one, I believe. They'll be posted uh, tonight, tomorrow. But three different shirts dropping, hoodies and t-shirts. This drop is um, all black, I do believe. There'll be colors possibly in the future. But those will drop Sunday, 10 a.m. You Are Your Enemy drop, number two. And yeah, so super hyped on you are your enemy stuff. I really, really like all the new stuff we're doing. I like being back on track. It's amazing. It feels great. And my knee still hurts. I don't really know. We're going to find out about this doctor soon. It's feeling a little better. It feels like it's just a torn meniscus to me or something like that. I'm not a doctor. That's what it feels like. I've had a lot of injuries in my life. So um, yeah, I'm going to take it easy this weekend though, for sure. I'm not going to do much except just draw and sit. So, which is what I do a lot anyway. No snowboarding for sure. No snowboarding until after it. LA at least. Um, and speaking of LA, 747 event coming up Friday, Saturday. We're going to be talking about it a lot this week, I guess. I keep getting constantly asked about which shoes I'm going to cop from the 747. So uh, I don't have them all memorized by any means. So I'm going to have to look at this real quick. Um, um, all right. So first, there's the Adidas Yeezy 500 Desert Rat Blush. Uh, I will not be copying this shoe. I will not be copying any Desert Rat. It is not Boost. It is Adipreen, which is a completely different technology from like the 80s, 90s, I can't remember. Don't hate the look of the shoe, but with the upper and there being no Boost, it's pretty much a no-brainer as to why I'm not getting it. Adidas Futurecraft 2.0 is what it's called. This is the white pair of the Futurecrafts. I would love to cop this shoe. I don't have any info yet as far as sizing. So. If there's a size 13, if I win the raffle or whatever, because there's wristbands, I have a few wristbands, so hopefully we come away with some shoes, but uh, yeah, I mean, all of this is contingent on what happens and, you know, situation. Yes, the Future Craft 4D, I'm very much looking forward to trying it out uh, and, you know, comparing it to Boost and, you know, discussing, discussing the things of the future. Um, Bape Adidas Dame 4, this is past for me. I don't like Bape. I don't really love the Dame 4, so yeah. I'm not into this like World War II plane. I might have got the World War wrong, but not into like the plane graphic thing on shoes. I think it should be left on planes, but that's just me, I guess. Adidas Crazy BYW X. This shoe I'm interested in, but I don't know because some friends of mine that have tried some of these pairs that only have these boost pop in one part of the shoe say they're still comfortable. So I really don't know. I'm interested in the X, but the lack of the front boost from what I can tell kind of turns me off, but I don't know. We'll have to see. Uh, Adidas Crazy BYW Level 1. This is just a different colorway than the previous that we have. This is, this is going to be a cop for sure with the black boots, the blue upper. It's just a little different. I love that BYW shoe, so uh, that's that's a definite cop. Uh, Adidas Y3 BYW Harden is an absolute must cop. I love the way this shoe looks. I'm super into this one. Upper kind of scares me a little bit. It's not PK looking, so I don't really know, but I do really like this shoe and I really like it. Adidas Harden Volume 2 is not a shoe that I'm going to get. A lot of people ask me about this one. Uh, I don't hate all the colorways or anything, but the shoe doesn't really speak to me. Not something that I think that I'm going to cop. Uh, Adidas Ultra Boost Parlay Mid. This is a shoe that I definitely want. Everyone knows I love Ultra Boost Mid, so uh, I'm going to go after it. Provided there's a 13, every other parlay in very few 13s, so we'll see what happens, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, the Alexander Wang D-Ball, which I have both the pairs of these that have released. This one I didn't even notice was different until someone pointed it out to me. Uh, it has like red accents here and there, lace system, aglet thing. I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna get these. I don't wear my b-balls that much that often. This shoe has a super like 90s Mack truck vibe to it. So I don't know if I like it or if I don't like it yet. I'll have to wait and see until I actually can see the shoe I guess. Adidas EQT BB80V. Pass. Three different Speed Factory shoes. Uh, there's the AM4 London, the AM4 Paris, and the AM4 LA. Uh, I won't be getting any of these. First off, they don't fit my foot. Uh, size 13 I haven't seen. People will claim that it exists, but everyone that I know in Europe, when they dropped, there were none. There was size 12, and I talked to the store manager, so I know, I know there was only a 12. Yeah, I'm probably not gonna get these. I've tried on a 12, it was super snug and did not feel good. A lot of people say these run big, but it just didn't feel good, and I'm not really, I like the color the way it looks, but the upper on the shoe, 
not super impressed with. So it's not my favorite thing that Adidas does. I don't own any. Also so far, not really like tripping. A black AM4 with the colored ribboning would be super fire. And I would probably freak out because there won't be a 13. Bristol Studios, BYW level one. Uh, but the Bristol, there's a black and a white pair. The black pair is rumored to be friends and family. I don't really know what's going on with this one. I don't even know if this is actually releasing at 747 or if it's just a releasing as a consortium. I gotta make some phone calls. I wanna check that one out too, but again, it changes the upper. It's gonna change the way the shoe feels. Um, I like the takes on it. I like the old like basketball jersey flips on it. It's super cool, but uh, we'll just have to, ch we'll just have to see. I don't, I don't really know. But I think that's all that I know of this dropping at 747. I'm sure I missed something. I'm sure there's more stuff being announced. It's gonna be crazy. I will be there Friday and Saturday. Pop up Sunday at, on Melrose at High Seas Tattoo Parlor at noon. And um, I have like three new designs I'm dropping in LA. Yeah, it should be a good time, but this no camera thing is pretty whack. Other than that, it should be a great time. I'm gonna get out of here. I hope you guys have a great weekend. Stay safe, stay healthy. Don't bust your knee up on a tree. And I'll see you on Monday and on Twitch and on live streams and on the internet and in the universe. Peace.